Hello, welcome to today's video. It's a big day today. We're back at the lawn which slopes down the bank. We've been working on it since middle of August last year when we came and it was just totally dead from the dry and we got it back and then we decided that this lawn is going to be a lawn that we can get back. Even though it's not the best lawn in the world, we're going to try and get it looking something like. So we started with moss treatments late last year and then we came earlier this year and we've been treating the weeds, we've been treating the moss. We've been scarifying, we've been top dressing and overseeding. Today is the big reveal of the results and I think you're going to be pretty impressed. But before I show you, let's just cast our mind back to all those times we've been before with a quick recap and then we can have a look at what the progress that we've made over the last few months. Okay, so back in August it looked like a straw field. So we made the decision that we're going to try a bit harder with it. So over the last few months we've been moss treating, weed treating, you can see now we join it on the 17th of March where we began our final scarify after scarifying it many times before. Probably shouldn't have done it this day because it was slightly wet and having just rained. And then we went on with our Berenbrug Extreme. The Berenbrug Extreme isn't really going to be able to crowd out what's already there. It was just to fill in alongside really. And then we went on with our field compost number four, lovely black peat free compost seed loves it because it gets really hot when the sun comes out and holds onto water uh, and we put a wetting agent on as well just to help that along so you can see they're just raking it in we didn't need to water it because it absolutely chucked it down within a few minutes of doing it so i got away with that one because i was worried it was all going to fall onto the road but it didn't so we came back a couple of weeks later and the seed had just started poking through so at this point, was I worried? No, because I knew it would come, but the temperatures just weren't there. And then a couple of weeks later, we gave it its first cut and we put our products on and we give it a dose of granular equilibrium. So what we're going to do now is we're going to join it back today, which is the 5th of May. So let's just have a look up close. You can see all the gaps there starting to fill in. Still a few, which have still got to come through, but they'll come. And over here as well, that was quite bare at one point, but it's coming. We we'll just have a look up close. See that it's lovely and thick now, nice and green, which is all we want really at the end of the day. All I've done on this lawn is I've wanted to do it. So I've showed you how you can take a lawn that looks not very nice and you think it's beyond help but with a little time and a little bit of effort and some good products you can get a lawn looking like this. Yep, yeah, it's not Wembley by any means but from where it was to where it is now I've proved that you can turn any lawn around and if you had this lawn which we had before and you end up with this your neighbours are going to be well gel. So let's just uh, have a walk over here where it's quite dry because of the hedge if you can have a look we knew this had happened but you can just see with the profile of the hedge that no water is getting to these areas so we know this isn't going to grow so you can see a difference how important water is that we need that for the grass to grow obviously with temperatures as well but we need that heat and the water combined so i'm really happy All right, that's this video done for today. It's just a real short one, but I just wanted to get these results back to you just because I want to follow up. I don't just want to leave things hanging and you're wondering what happened to it or something's gone wrong. We always show what happened right or wrong, whether it's gone wrong or turned out beautiful. We always show you like this one. So what I've got coming up for this weekend is it's a coronation weekend. It's Friday the 5th today. So we're at Howard's tomorrow and we're going to be polishing off that back and that front, they're looking absolutely fantastic considering the weather we've had. So I'm really looking forward to that and I've got a big surprise to reveal as well, just to help us on our way. So we'll see you there. So if you want to see more lawns being turned around like this, join us next time on Daniel Hibbert Lawn Expert. Bye for now and don't forget to like and subscribe. See you soon.